hi everyone welcome to the youtube channel in this video we will talk about the qcoin withdrawal security settings so if you want to withdraw your coins or maybe any kind of currency and you're just afraid of any kind of scam or maybe hacking and you just want the security in all over that process so there are many different options through which you can do it you just have to follow a few steps that are being done in this video and you can easily make your withdrawal settings secure so first you have to make sure that you have already installed a qcoin app if you don't then you can still do it if you're using the iphone then you have to head towards the app store but if you're using the google chrome then you have to go to the google play store once you go to the google play store there you just have to simply search for qcoin once you find its app which is this one make sure you install it and once it gets installed you just have to simply open it up and once you open it up it will just take three seconds and after that you will see its interface so this is how its app looks like here you can see we have a lot of options almost everywhere on the screen so at the bottom we have some of the options at the top and even in the middle of the screen so from all these options on the left top side you can see we have an icon if you have uploaded any profile picture up there it will be there instead of that you will see this me option up there you just have to simply click on this option and after that your profile or you can see some of the settings and options will open so here we have different options and every option here is different from each other and has its own purpose you have to click on this security option and at the top you can see it is security and all these options are related to what stuff that could secure your account and from all these options you can see we have this second option which is the trading password so what you have to do is that you just have to simply set that password for that you have to click on it and first it will ask you to verify your email like it will send a verification to your email address you have to get it and just simply paste up here and after that you just have to simply click on this confirm option after that it will show you this pop-up you have to click on to this got it option again it will take some time to load and once the loading is done it will take us to the next page so at this page it doesn't allow the screen recording but in this page what is happening is that now you just have to simply set a password you have to add a password and you have to re-enter it to confirm it once you do so your password will be set and make sure you keep that password secure and also make it strong so you can only crack it so make sure that it is all good and also remember to save it somewhere and once you have simply set the password this will be your security setting so whenever you're doing any kind of withdrawals transactions buying selling anything which includes import and export of any kind of currency then you have to enter this password so that's how you can secure your trading or you can set the transaction password unfortunately this app doesn't allow the screen recording therefore you can't see it it was all black but you just have to simply set a password and whenever you do any kind of transaction from your wallet or maybe from your account you have to add that password so this is how you can secure your transaction settings so i'll show you once again you just have to simply get back and you have to open the qcoin app it will just take a while to load initially once it is open you will see this interface now you have to click on this icon which is in the top left and from all these options you have to choose this option which is security simply click on this option and after that you will see these options from there you have to simply go to the second option and after that you have to simply set a password that will be your transaction password so whenever you do any kind of transaction swapping any kind of sending receiving or whatsoever related to import and exchange of any kind of currency or money this password you have to set i hope you found this video helpful and informative in case if you have not subscribed to the youtube channel then make sure to subscribe it for more informative videos and updates you can also press the bell icon button so whenever a new video gets uploaded you can get notified if you have any queries feel free to ask in the comment section below and is there any specific topic that you're looking for you may mention in the comment section below also remember to leave a like comment and do share the video and at the last thank you so much for watching the video